So Footprints of an Angel, your uh, latest single. Uh, what was it like? Because uh, I know you have a role in the film. Yes. Talk to us about the film and what the song is really about. Well, the song, um, uh, I play uh, a mother. I play a mother. Well, they call me Nana uh -huh. in the film. But uh, my daughter, um, she went out in the streets and, and got with the wrong crowd and started using drugs and uh -huh. all that stuff. And uh, had a baby. Okay. And cleaned up her act and came home. And we were so glad, you know, as a mother, I'm right. glad for her to be home. Right. And uh, after she's home for a little while, we find out she has cancer. Wow. And uh, she passes away in the film. In the film. Yes. So I have to sing at my own daughter's Here. funeral. Wow. Yeah. So wow. Um, the name of the movie is called Footprints of an Angel, and they didn't have a theme song for it. Uh -huh. So uh, we went home after we did my scenes. And, um, you know, I thought about uh, writing the theme song and coming up with like a female David Ruffin kind right, of thing, right, right. you know, for this era. And uh, we, I love that loop in uh, Ain't Nothing Like the Real Thing. Right, right. And we got Sebastian here, who happens to be a beat maker. Okay. <laughs> so when he Tennessee's came home. Tennessee's finest. Yeah, that's my fiance. Uh -huh. So when I told him about it, um, I told him, I said, I want this specific part of, uh, you know, ain't nothing like the real thing. And he kept saying, no, I think you want this part. And I yeah. was like, no, I want that part. No, I think you want this part. He was right. Yeah. <laughs> so he, he sampled that and got it. And we went in the studio and did it. And it turned out wonderful. So after that, we have to get the clearance. Of course. For it, right? The record label. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. So um, uh, we went around. Sony actually has the uh, rights to it. Yes. We called Sony and we got somebody to go in. They said, oh, well, Sony won 7000 for this and yeah. 6000 for they that. Nickel and dime. 65% of, of this and of the streaming and blah, blah, blah. And then I remembered that I really had recorded a snippet of this with actual Valerie and Nick yes. on one of my albums, right, right, you know, right. the I Remember album, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So I called Valerie. And See, that's yeah, how you do yeah. it. <laughs> and I sent her the song, and uh, I think it reminded her of Nick. Yeah. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. So she uh, hit me back, and she said, I told them, you know, that I approved the song and leave you alone. That's what's up. Yeah, and so, so you got the song free and clear. Yeah. <laughs> that's, what's, that's always the best one.